this. Um, I'm really hoping. So, I promised a Harley Quinn makeup tutorial. Um, so I'm gonna go see the movie today. Right now it's 10 o'clock, and I'm gonna I'm leaving my house in an hour and a half to go watch to go to the movie. Um, I have a one o'clock thing that I'm going to my friend's house first. Um, we're gonna take photos because she's gonna be the Joker. So sorry, that's a really long explanation. So first, I'm gonna prime my face with Elf. Poreless face primer in the color clear. And I'm not sure that I like this yet. I don't like how it smells, definitely. But it kind of smells like Vicks cold cream, you know? Or, you know, the stuff you put on your throat when you can't breathe and then you can magically breathe. It kind of smells like that, but slightly less strong. But it still smells virtually the same, so. This mirror is really dirty. <laughs> Alright, so the next thing I'm going to do is use my Kat Von D Tattoo Lock Foundation in the color Light 45. And my e.l.f. powder brush to buff it in. That awkward moment when you realize that you forgot to uh, color correct your face. So I'm going to do that now, after my foundation's on. I'm just going to use my e.l.f. Corrective Concealer in Erase and Conceal, just to cover up my dark circles. And it makes my face a little bit paler, which I kind of need. Plus, I mean, I can just highlight with it. I mean, I don't really need my face to be any better for this cosplay, but, uh... This would make your face look better. I'm just using the red color. And my beauty blender. Alright, I'm just gonna grab something real quick. My shorts are my reference for like what side my face is red and the other which side is blue. That way I can remember. And I don't have my primer over here. Um, so I'm gonna be right back. I'm just gonna use my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. I'm really not prepared today. I. Mm. This is just in, I don't think this has a color, this is just the original formula. All of my stuff fell out. Everything just fell. Just everything fell out. I'm priming my eyes. I'm also going to just very quickly fill in my address. I have no technique for this in case you can't tell. I kind of just... Mm. Now I'm going to use my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. I'm 
just so that way I have a decent base. All right, now on to the eye makeup. So I'm gonna start off with the red. And for the red, I'm just using like a pink, not even using a red, I'm using a pink eyeshadow. And a water bottle as well. And the red goes on the right side of your face. Now I'm going to go in with my Swamp Cream palette in the color Dogman, which obviously you don't have to use this specific color. It's like um, it's like a brownish red, so I just want to add a teeny bit of depth because I am that person, and I think it makes it slightly better. I'm gonna use just a different brush. I'm just gonna use a straight up fluffy, fluffy brush. Now onto the blue, I'm going to be using the exact same brush I used with the red, which is the e.l.f. Professional Eyeshadow Brush, and a Sephora um, single palette in the, cool, the color Swimming Pool. Did I just say single eyeshadow palette? That's not a thing. I love the singles. I, this was like a gift or a hand-me-down to me. But I have no idea if they still even make this. You can see how often I use it. And now I'm just going to take my e.l.f. professional eye crease brush and a darker blue. Now I'm going to take my Jordana Fabu Liner Liquid Eyeliner. This is just black. It's just straight up black. Oh shoot, I got on my shirt. I'm going to do the heart and I'm going to my friend's house so my friend's going to write rotten on my face. Um, because I don't have the proper angle, but of course you can always write the word rotten on your face. So, yeah, this is kind of... This is not the finished product, I don't know, I was going to say that. Now I'm going to go in with my Jordana Easy Liner for Lips Retractable Pencil in Sedona Red. And my NYX Butter Lipstick in the color Big Cherry. I want it. I, it, it should be messy. Just keep in mind, by the way, that this is a very messy look. So you could always like make it less messy. But and now I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. Gel uh, Eyeliner and just a I like a brush. I normally tend to use like flat brushes. I'm gonna give myself a wing eyeliner. And then if you want, you can always add glitter. I'm not a glittery person, but I saw like Nikki Tutorials posted one a, a tutorial and she had like glitter. So like obviously you can always add glitter. This is my eyebrows are very uneven. But I don't really care. So 
yeah now i have to worry about it on my face and then i have the tattoos on my legs so.